So this is Eclipse 2017. It's getting darker right and now. Cold. And it's actually getting freezing here. So this is really weird. Hey, welcome back. Holy crap. So me, uh, or I guess my family and I, we just got done watching the eclipse and I'm going to put a little clip at the end of this episode here. Um, so you guys can watch that. You guys don't have to, but it's going to be at the end. So we'll get to some Clash Royale first and then you guys can watch my family watching the eclipse. Absolutely insane. Uh, definitely one of the coolest things I've ever seen in my life. I'm not even kidding. Uh, definitely did not expect something that cool. Um, so anyway, if you guys have a second, go to the end of this video and watch that, or just watch the whole video. <laughs> I mean, you might as well. Anyway, we're going to get into this, and I don't know if I am the only one who has noticed this, but if you guys checked out that 2v2 button, do you guys see this? I mean, like, there's no end date. That's awesome, right? Does that mean 2v2 is permanent? Does that mean it's never going to go away again? Because before it had like an end date and it had like a, a timer, countdown timer or whatever, but I don't see any countdown timer. So that's, that's awesome. Uh, I mean, maybe, I mean, obviously a few other people have seen this probably somewhere, <laughs> but I just haven't seen it anywhere. Uh, also Mega Knight coming out in 18 days, which probably means there's a challenge going to be coming up this next week or something. So that's pretty sweet. Um, super jacked up about that. I do not know exactly what, I'm trying to think of something I could build, uh, around the Mega Knight, but I'm not sure what I could build. I thought about building maybe one of his like hand things, a big ball with spikes on it, you know, maybe doing that, but I don't know. Anyway, I'm still working on that stinking <laughs> Night Witch's staff. It's taking me years. Anyway, so let's get into what the, the meat of the, uh, the video here. Uh, I'm feeling fairly confident with this deck. I'm actually going to see how it does in grand challenges right now. I want to make sure that this is a viable deck in the challenges. Uh, I think it's been doing pretty well for, on ladder for me. If you go to Clash Royale, the cool thing is about, uh, sorry, not Clash Royale, but Stats Royale. The cool thing about Stats Royale is you can go check out your your decks that you've been using and check out your own like win percentage with those decks. Um, so you kind of see which decks are actually better for you as well. It's a way cool, way cool little tool. I, I mean like, dang, I don't know what I'm going to do here. Uh, this is a problem. <laughs> How come those minions didn't get like halfway killed the ice skull oh because the lumberjack took him out in front okay that's what happened anyway so this deck like i'm saying is working out pretty decent for me um with the hog rider in there and the miner uh, i'm just gonna pull hog down right now and see what he has for me it looks like oh really that's actually kind of cool um we're gonna go poison that i guess uh little ice skull action to distract the bats should clean up rather nicely. Um, bats also will come back and hit those goblins, and then that musketeer will die. We're going to throw a full-fledged miner, hopefully to tank for those bats. Not soon enough. Either way, he had the ice wizard down, so not too concerned. Um, dang it, dude. The ice wizard is going to take out the mega minion, so he will not get any swings on all that. I think I am going to go ahead and zap that, just so I don't take any more tower damage, because at this point in the game where we're so close, every hit does count he does have the elite barbs and the musketeer so what am i going to do about that let's see if i can get up to elixir before he does if that is the case i will definitely yep i'm going to go ahead and put my hog rider down um let's go poison oh 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 please oh please oh please take him out oh yes dude that was the most value poison you've ever seen in your life that worked out extremely well Almost took the musketeer down to zero. Wow, that musketeer shoots really fast, guys. Really fast. We're going to get a miner in there with the ice golem tanking. Uh, ooh, just a little bit off on my timing there. That was my bad. Now I'm going to drop Mega Minion in the back. We have a little bit of a problem. If he puts his lumberjack down, I don't see... Um, sorry about that. My battery just died. I don't know what happened. Uh, the stinking camera doesn't give any notice whatsoever. Um, on when my battery's gonna die anyway so you'll see here I mean this is basically just I, my my game was still recording so basically pulling out the rest of the match we were able to throw down some poison some crazy crap and basically get this match finished out so anyway let's go ahead let's get into match number two with this deck 
I think I used most of my battery up with the <laughs> recording the eclipse. That's what happened, and then I didn't put a new battery in. I'm an idiot. My bad. Anyway, we'll get into match number two here with this deck. Uh, I have not played an expo yet, so this is going to be a real treat. Um, let's go ahead. Let's throw a mini P.E.K.K.A. down, I guess, um, and then some bats. Hopefully, we can get our bats down. Um, do something crazy with that. Maybe I'm putting a little too many cards down. Yeah, I probably am. Let's go ahead. Let's let's attack the other side with that, and then some bats over here as well. Um, see what he has to answer. See if he has any response to that. Probably nothing. It looks like we are going to take that tower out. That is pretty much game over right there. I can stop his expo. He, I mean, it's pretty much over at this point. Like I don't know what he was doing. Come on, Nate, pay attention. You got to defend that. I don't think he guarded his expo very well as well, um, unfortunately. I kind of feel bad for him. So, either I'm betting he gave up. He may have given up already. No. Dude, he looks like... That's what he's going to put down an Inferno Tower? So, he hasn't given up, but he decided to put down an Inferno Tower just to defend the crap out of me. So, that's really awesome. I'm going to go Mini P.E.K.K.A. and then we're going to go Miner right here. Um, Mini P.E.K.K.A. will take that tower out really quick. And then the Miner... Pretty much won't do anything, but I don't know. Just felt like that was the only thing I could do at the moment. Let's go ahead. We're gonna put some bats down here in just a second, and then cycle around to our ice golem because that's what we gotta do. Boom, boom, boom! Ice golem right there, and then we will take that out with the hog rider. Hog rider will go ahead and take that expo out real fast. Uh, Mega minion will take out the ice wizard, and hog rider will still get probably two shots off on the tower here. One, oh, ice spirit. Nicely saved with the Ice Spirit. Props to you, buddy. Nicely done. Why is this guy, like, talking so much? Why is he so grateful? What am I? What have I done for him? Um, besides just... Mm, took his expo out. He's probably kind of pissed about that. Let's go... Let's go mini peck in the back, I guess. Really? Interesting play. Oh, crap. <laughs> I actually screwed that up. He tricked me a little bit there. That was actually really smart. He did trick me. Uh, <laughs> did not see that coming. That's okay. All we pretty much have to do is defend here, which I don't see that being a problem. We're going to take out his Ice Wizard right here. We will do that. Um, he's expecting the Hog Rider, which that's what I would expect as well. So we'll go ahead and put it down for him. Oh! Oh, we're going to zap just for fun. Let's go Ice Golem right here. We're going to go like that. Boom, boom. Boom, boom. Okay, there we go. Put some bats all over there. Basically, we just got to stop his Expo the way I see it. And I think we can do that pretty decently. Let's go. We might as well go Hog Rider. Let's get this in here. Let's get Let's get some more. What are you? Dude, what are you doing? What are you doing? Just quit. Just give me a tower. <laughs> give me another tower. I guess I don't need it. I don't need my crown chest right now. So that worked out decent. I don't... I'm not going to say it crushed Expo because I think he kind of messed up. So I feel bad for Nate. But is what it is. The deck did good. We won. So let's take our victory. And let's keep on going. Okay? Let's keep on going. So, initially, I started using Nova One Mormons. <laughs> it's funny. Anyway, so, initially, I started using this deck on the ladder and then moved on over... Well, this is the first time that I used it in a challenge, and I, I kind of like it. I think it's doing great. I really do. Uh, Pekka should do pretty well against that Hog Rider. Uh, whoa, actually, guess not. He did... He had a good placement with the... Uh, oh, crap. Is he using the same deck I'm using? I've never seen this deck used before, but he's using it. <laughs> he's got Pekka Bats. He's got, like, everything that I got. I thought I was the only one using this deck. <laughs> what? What? Nice job, buddy. And he played it better than I did. Dude, he smoked my tower. Well done, Brian from Nova 1. Um, this is a problem. I really don't have anything. Uh, I'll just kind of block the Hog Rider, I guess. Try and take it out with my miner. Dang, that was really unfortunate that that had to go down like that. Very well played. Holy crap, that hurts my feelings. Let's get a hog rider in there with some bats. Come on, get bats in there. Let's go. Boom! Oh, he took out my miner. This is really oh, nicely done. That was a good ice spirit by him because that killed all my bats. That worked out really well for him. Unfortunately, I think he shouldn't have uh, done the lightning there. That's where our decks do differ. I have poison. He has lightning. So, that tower's gone, so he's not going to attack that tower anymore. So, the unfortunate thing is here, I got Ice Golem behind my P.E.K.K.A. I wish I had P.E.K.K.A. in front of my Ice Golem. Let's go, doom. Let's go like that. And let's just distract the crap out of that thing. Boom, 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 boom. 
Really? That's what you're going to do? Again? Come on, get up there, Hog Rider. Dude, if we don't get logged, we are in really good shape. Oh, Ice Spear. Oh, but the Ice Spear did not stop the Hog Rider, so Hog Rider and Mega Minion are going to go to town on that dude. I'm going to poison here just for kicks. Um, I think that will help us get... Oh, yes, yes, it did take out the e Wiz and help get quite a bit more damage on that tower. So super jacked up about that. Um, let's go Mini P.E.K.K.A. Um, I'm going to go ahead and zap this time and Ice Golem. Should be able to take that out without too much. Really? He did it again? That is interesting. I don't think Lightning would be the best move there, but... Dude, this is your game. This is your game. We're going to go ahead and poison that. Um, take all that action out. He still doesn't have this tower over here. Keep that in mind. So he still does have to take this tower out, and he has to take that tower out. So let's go ahead. We're going to go zap. Stop him. Uh, ooh, nicely done with taking out... Ooh, that was actually ooh, really close. If he didn't have to take both towers out, he'd be in business, man. I'm going to stop that. I don't want him to take that tower just in case something... Oh, because he could have lightning. Yeah, he could have lightning. He could have done that. The only thing different in our decks, he had a good starting play. He had lightning. I had poison. Um, he had E-Wiz, I guess. Um, and I had Mega Minion. So that worked out really well. Nice job, Brian, from Nova One Mormon Mormons. <laughs> but anyway... Uh, that deck, if you guys have not had a chance to try it out, definitely try it out. Um, so, stay tuned <laughs> if you want. Uh, I'm going to show the video of my family watching the Eclipse coming up right here. Anyway, take it easy, guys, and good luck. Can we talk to the camera? Hey, camera time. It's Eclipse time. Woo! This is the family. This is Logan. This is Parker. This is, uh, obviously my wife, Tanner. <laughs> And we have Cooper over here. I don't know if you can see him. Cooper, Parker, come. Move. Parker, please don't. <laughs> what are you doing? And Remy's asleep. And Remy's asleep. So, this is Eclipse 2017. It's getting darker right and now. Cold. And it's actually getting freezing here. So, this is really weird. Uh, what was the temperature a minute ago? It was almost 90 degrees a second ago. I bet it's like 70 degrees now. I bet it's like. It's freezing. Would it tell? Where would it tell? Yeah. Almost there! That fast. But it's getting darker. Don't look at like it. Like it's almost. Glasses, glasses on. It's like nighttime. <laughs> this is crazy. Yes, anyway, yes, Eclipse yes, 2017. Yes, yes, yes. It's gonna be nighttime in three minutes. Dude, oh, it's cold. This is cold. This is it nuts. Is cold. This is frozen. Holy cow! This is crazy. Okay, that is pretty cold. I can't this see is crazy. It. Don't come in by yourself. It's getting totally dark. Don't see it. <laughs> Dude, it is getting weird, guys. This is how the end of the world would be. What really? if we didn't see the sun for this many days? What the heck? Do we need to turn our lights on? Oh, that's <laughs> oh. cool. Yeah. <laughs> okay, don't what look at the sun. What just in there and it, and it just goes dark and it's like, oh, oh look at that one sun. So as soon as it gets oh, all the way. Oh, I'm kind of scared. <laughs> Oh Wait, my gosh! Woo! Holy crap! That is here, nuts! Here. Oh my gosh! Wait, are we allowed to look at that? I don't know. Can we look at that? You can look at it in totality. That what is that crazy. Wait, it's completely not, blocked. You can, can look, look at, at it. it. You can. That is nuts, guys! Oh, guys! Okay. Oh my gosh. That is crazy. I Wait. wonder if I can get that on film. film. Oh, heck. Is there Wait, any way I can get that on film? That no. Sun? This is the sun right now. No. This okay. is nuts. This is nuts. Holy crap. This is crazy. That is the coolest thing I've ever seen in my life almost. Dude, that is just like, that is nuts. This is awesome. Check that out. You can't see it, huh? Like you can see it, kinda. That is so crazy. Holy cow, look how dark it is here. It was just light just a minute ago. It was like just a second ago. Oh my gosh. Look at this. Where are you going? Woo! Oh, holy crap. Dude, that is so cool. That is cool. Oh my gosh. This is like the middle of the day? Oh. <laughs> it's, it's 11. Okay, 11 maybe this was cool. What the fetch? It's nighttime. Let's go to bed. And it's just morning. What the heck? Look at it move, Logan. 
That is crazy. I'm gonna be blind after this. <laughs> nah. I guess you can look at it in totality. When it's like completely covered like this. This is awesome. That is so cool. Burr. <laughs> Guys can't look at it anymore. Okay? Oh, guys, we're looking at it. Okay. Okay. Get out of the way of my camera, Will. Guys, you need your glasses. Hopefully, it was recording. Weird. What the heck? Mom, that's funny. That is creepy. Daddy, look with the glasses. It looks like a little tiny dot. I know. That is crazy. Look at the way that. Well, what was that? Popcorn. Popcorn? Yeah, look at it. What? Wait, I want to see this with the glasses. <laughs> That's it. That won't happen for another 20 years. Uh, 100 years. 100 years. Oh. Look at it! Fireworks! That's so loud! Oh, this is weird. Wait, where is it now? Dude, that really was the coolest thing ever. That really was cool. That was awesome! I bet this blinded like a thousand people, though. For being dumb. Dude, that was crazy. This oh is crazy. God. That was the most surreal thing I've ever seen in my life. What did you guys think? Did you guys like that? Is that weird? I can see you guys again! Did you guys like that? It's all bright again!